When you're ready, bro. All right, welcome back to the fight talk today. I am joined by PJ over Flo for like the third time this week. Yeah, yeah, yeah man. How are you doing, bro? I'm good. It's nice to finally have an interview in person with you, right? Like this yeah. is at the event in person. Yeah, at the event in person. It's kind of nice. It feels good, better than Zoom. Yeah, bro. I interviewed you like yesterday in the way in. Yeah, yeah, but my whole my whole week has been a blur. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> yeah. I feel like I've been drunk all week because. The amount of stuff that I've done, the lack of sleep, and the preparation for the Happy Bunch event has just been so insane that to finally have it all done is a nice feeling. I might go celebrate, yeah. you know? Who knows? Yeah. I think it went great. How do you feel about the fights? Bro, amazing. Amazing. Absolutely. I'm not just saying that because you're here and it's part of Happy Punch. Guys, if you guys were at the stadium or arena right now, comment down below because it's been an amazing event so far. Bro, so it's packed. It's packed yeah. already. Credit to you For and Keemstar. Credit to you and Keemstar. Thank you. Prelims has been amazing. Listen, by night it's here. Yeah. The main card is starting as we speak right now. The first fight. The first fight right now. Listen, we're going to get straight right into it. I want to get a prediction on three fights. I know I've asked you previously, yeah. but I want to see if your predictions have changed. Okay. What is your prediction for Deji versus Swarms? Uh, I love both the guys. Yeah. I have to always preface it with that. I never want to see anybody lose or win. I want to see everybody get out there, have an entertaining fight, and have a fun time, and come out safe. That's what I always want for everybody, right? Yeah. Um, I've, I love Swarms. Swarms is a great guy. Saying that, Deji's been my boy for years and years. Yeah. I yeah. love Deji. I can never go against Deji. Um, and I do think that experience-wise, Deji, you can say whatever you want. He's got four losses. He's got this. What do you consider to be experience? I consider experience experience. Yep. That's just the truth, man. Win or lose, being in there does so much more for you. So I think Deji definitely has the upper hand. I'd have to agree with you. You know, Deji's inspired me a lot. Mm. Come back from losses, you can always come back. Mm. And you know what? He's inspired me because I want to get into the ring one day. Yeah, good. Hopefully one day I'll be on a on a, some sort of card. Yes. But let's Maybe get a happy punch prelim. Why not, man? Happy punch. Hey, let's make it happen, Keem. <laughs> so let's get into Salt Pappy versus Anthony Taylor. This is the fight that I can't give my prediction because yeah. I love both of the guys. I know them both personally. It's going to be a hard fight to judge who's going to win. Both of them are part of Happy Punch. Right. How do you see that fight going? Um, I'm going to say this. I think it's one of the best fights on the I card, thought. 100%. It could headline its own show. Yeah. Uh, being that they're both my Happy Punch guys, I can't pick against either of them. Fair enough. I'm obligated to not say who, yep, but I do think that it is going to be probably the best fight of the night. I think it's going to be the best fight this year of influencer boxing in general. Oh, it's going to be insane. Definitely, because Pappy, it's his first time he's been tested. Yeah. First time Anthony Taylor's going off against someone a bit more skilled. Mm. Credit, he had uh, Tommy Fury as well, but in the influencer boxing scene, Pappy is the most skilled guy for Anthony. For sure. And do you know what? I'm not going to give my prediction for that either. You're not going to you're not going to either. Let's get into JJ versus Joe Fournier. Yeah. The big fight of the night, the one that we're waiting for. So, PJ, what happens? Man, this one's really the toughest test that JJ has had, right? You got a guy, perfect record. Yeah. He's a tough guy. He has championship belts. Um and I have to say, credit to him. He came into space and he's super entertaining. I think everybody really like he's charismatic. Yeah. People I didn't expect that. I didn't really know of him before. And he came in the space and he really um, is making a bunch of, you know, good quotes. He's really making a bunch of memes even. Yeah. And, and he's really played his role well. Having said that, I think that JJ has something that most people in the world will never have. It's why he's successful in so many fields. Yeah. And I think that um, as of right now, he's unstoppable. You know, I think JJ is going to steamroll everybody in his way as of right now. I'm going with JJ. Also been my guy forever. So I can never go against him. Specific round for JJ? I'm thinking mid rounds. Joe, I think it's going to be too tough for KSI to take him out early on, but I think once you get to the middle rounds, uh, you're going to see that that fatigue wear in, and fatigue makes cowards of us all. Yeah. Right. I agree with you. I think JJ is going to struggle in the first round. He's going to struggle adjusting to the pro boxer. Yeah. Then start breaking him down, and I got round four for JJ TKO. Yeah, yeah. I think we talked about this. I think yeah. round four would be a, a yeah. great guess. I think he's going to have to figure out where he's at exactly. Um, in that first round, he's going to have to figure out where he's at with the pro boxer. But once he gets that and once he gets the rhythm, I think that he, he can uh, come out strong. PJ, last words for your fans, for the Happy Punch fans as well. What are your last words? Oh, man, I'm just so excited. I'm just so excited. There's so much work that went into this. Me and Kim were up, no sleep all week, getting everything done, literally nonstop around the clock work. And to have it finally be done, and it went so perfect, I just want to say thank you to everybody who watched, who was a part of it. We appreciate you guys. PJ, I appreciate all your time you've given me this week, and I really appreciate it. Hopefully, you have a great fight night. Thank you, bro. I appreciate you.
Thank you, bro. Without you guys, this wouldn't be what it is. Thank you, guys. Appreciate you a lot, man. Nice to meet you, man. I saw you yesterday when I 